25 years ago when Azerbaijan just became independent and was weak and unprotected, our neighbor Armenia uh, invaded 20% of our territory, but even more tragically, expelled around 1 million Azerbaijanis from their homes and lands. A true and simple ethnic cleansing. Around 400,000 of those people were children, all innocent victims of this tragedy. And because of the invasion and ethnic and the presence of Armenia's armed forces today still on our soil, despite the international condemnation, despite the UN Security Council resolutions, all these people, refugees, are not allowed to return to their homes. And we very much appreciate that the State of Israel has always supported Azerbaijan in our struggle for justice and stood by us, always. We were also very much touched and moved when we saw the President of Israel, Reuven Rivlin, last year speak, address the UN General Assembly on their Holocaust Remembrance Day and mention um, this injustice that was committed against Azerbaijan people, drawing publicly attention to this problem, which sometimes is thought to be forgotten, uh, frozen, that sometimes they say, but it's not frozen at all, as the last escalation this April showed, when hundreds of uh, people were killed on the line of contact we have with Armenian troops. So that support is a true sign of a genuine and profound friendship we share with Israel. 